Hello everyone, I'm Elizabeth Vincent. Today I'm going to continue to show you how to captivate your clients, your team members and your end users with prototypes that function almost as well as the final product. In part one of this tutorial, we created a simple mobile phone prototype with Axure 7 and I promised you a second video, remember that? Well, this is part two of that video and I show you step by step how to display this prototype on an iPhone 5 mobile device. What you're looking at now is a simulation of how that same prototype will look and function on an iPhone 5 mobile device. Let's get started. The first thing you need to do is to access the prototype you created in part one. So now go to publish, generate HTML files, and then in the general tab, use this button to select the folder where you will put in the generated HTML files. Underneath here, select without sitemap, go to the mobile device tab, make sure that include viewport tag is selected, Make sure that auto detect and link phone numbers is selected. Hide browser nav, make sure that's selected. Now, four other important things you need to do are as follows. Over here in the initial scale section, make sure that 1.0 is typed in. For minimum scale, type in 1.0 again. For maximum scale, type in 1.0. And then for usable scale, say no. Now generate those HTML files. So there you have it. You have just generated the HTML files for your prototype. So now that you've done that, you can place those files that you've generated on your server. That way you can view it on your iPhone 5 mobile device. For convenience, I've put it on my server and you can access it on your mobile phone by going to best2xdesigner.com forward slash mobile menu forward slash home dot html. And for a simulation of that iPhone 5 mobile device, this is what it would look like. On your device, when you tap on the menu button at the top right hand corner, the menu should be displayed. When you tap on it again, the menu should be hidden. So there you have it. This has been a step-by-step -step guide on how to display this prototype on your mobile phone device. Be sure to subscribe to my channel using the subscribe button below. Comment on this tutorial by using one of the links below and like this tutorial using the like button located below as well. I look forward to seeing you at my next tutorial. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.